I have returned to this roaster called Pilgrims after more than three years. 2019, I was here last. And I remember the roaster, the barista, he of course doesn't remember me. He serves like 2,000 uh, customers every day. I remember him, he's still here. Great place, amazing location, very nice vibes. Good choice of coffee. I haven't bought a bag yet, had an espresso. Oh, very good, very, very good. Pretty outstanding. I would have liked a little bit more body. Nice balanced acidity and sweetness. This is a Colombian. He did say though that it would be maybe more on the darker side, which it is not. I mean, it is probably what I'm salivating is really good. Did not have a pour over, though the last time I did have a pour over. I really like this place. Very good espresso he made. I love the layout of the place as well. Huge big windows, nice place to sit inside. You have a few places to sit outside as well. I'm sitting at one of the places outside and there's also sitting right next to the street. Great place, nice vibes. Now, as you can see, I'm sitting right on the outside. Delightful place to be, to sit and have coffee. I'm on a Monday afternoon though, and it's not as busy as I would have thought it would be. In fact, it's not busy at all. And how would I rate this place? I really enjoy it. So I, on a scale of one to five, I would probably give it a, I don't know, 4.7. Great talking to the barista. Very friendly, very knowledgeable. Good choice of bags, different kinds of coffee. They don't yet have a natural. I didn't find a natural over here, but I, I didn't buy a bag. So I will talk about coffee if, when I buy the bag to see how it goes. But as of now, espresso, delightful. In my quest for good coffee in the Philly region, this is arguably one of my preferred places. I haven't yet bought a bag from here, so I'll let you know when I buy a bag from here, how the bag, how I managed to brew that bag from the roasters here. In the meanwhile, you guys can leave a comment in the comment section down below of what you think of Pilgrims if you have been here. If not, you can check out my other Philly roasters that I have visited and I'll be definitely seeing you in the next one when I'll be brewing or visiting another roaster. Now this part of the film was actually shot significantly later when actually I bought a number of bags from, from Pilgrims. Notably, I bought a Costa Rican Geisha, I bought a Mexican Geisha blend, and I bought a Brazilian, and one more bag that I do not exactly recall, but all four of them with the exception of the Brazilian, I should say, all, all these coffees turned out to be absolutely delicious. I took them with me to India and I tasted them with friends of mine in India. That's the famed geisha from Costa Rica. Sugo, you want to smell the beans? Yeah, yeah. And it stands to that type. Really? I think you can extract more flavors from it. I tasted them with the family and everybody agreed to Pilgrims being a good roaster, even though none of these people actually have been to Philly, barring my mother, of course. And these coffees turned out to be absolutely fantastic, actually. And so highly recommend Pilgrims. Do let me know in your comment section down below if you have had coffee from Pilgrims Roasters in Manayang, Philadelphia. And I'll be replying to your comments. Thanks for watching. Brew a nice coffee. And I'll be seeing you in the next one.